Hello, welcome to this campaign for voiceless and vulnerable children. This campaign tries to draw attention of the public to the plight of poor and vulnerable children in the society. And that is what we do. By simply watching our videos and subscribing, you're already doing a lot to get a child back to school. Today, I feel obligated to talk about something. There's this video that went viral last week. And I'm really grateful to the guy that made that video. I want to talk about it. But first of all, I will allow you to watch the video. First of all. Yeah, you saw that, right? After that video went viral last week, we quickly got a response from the government. The government quickly went down to the school and took over the place and began to do things to rehabilitate the school and put the place in a very good condition. And that's beautiful. And that's why I say I'm grateful to the guy that made that video. But do we always need to wait for somebody to bring this thing to the public before we run to the place to do something about it? You know, sincerely speaking, I am happy something was done about that school. But this was just to score a political point. This was just politics. There are so many other situations right now that children are going through. There are many traumatic situations I have seen that even our organization, Child Plus Africa, we have intervened in so many of them. These conditions are there. The government is seeing them. The government is aware of them. People are writing petitions, writing, things, writing to the government every day concerning these things and nothing is done about it. But the moment this thing is taken to the media and it looks like it's going to tarnish the image of the government, within seconds, within minutes, you'll see how efficient our government can be. That's not good. That's not the way to go. There are so many situations that need attention. And I am here to talk as an organization. There are so many situations that need attention. The government knows it. But the truth is that I have long given up on the government doing anything about these things. And that is why we do the much we can with our limited resources and with the help of some of you. Because there are many of you that have assisted us. I am trying to make one simple point today. Let us not wait for the government. You and I are going to change the situations. When you see things happening around you, 
when you see situations that are not good, speak out. Scream. Shout at the top of your voice. Let people come and see. Draw attention as much as you can to that situation. Let's force the government to do something about it. And where we can do something about it by ourselves. Let us not relent. My name is Chiki Ziogazic, as you know. Every child deserves attention. Every child deserves the best. God bless you.